more accessible than DLSS 3 and DFSR 3 with frame generation technology will be available on Radeon, GeForce and even on Intel Arc graphics cards. AMD just announced the Radeon RX 7800 XT and RX 7700 XT and fully announced the FSR 3 super sampling technology, which was nominally introduced earlier this year. FSR 3 follows in the footsteps of DLSS 3 and includes the fluid motion frame generation technology. This can significantly boost performance. For example, in the game Forspoken at 4K resolution with maximum graphics settings and active ray tracing without FSR 3, the performance on Radeon RX 7900 XTX was only 36 FPS, whereas with FSR 3 in performance mode it increases to 122 FPS. Of course, in quality mode performance will be lower, but it is still at a much higher level compared to FSR 2. FSR 3, like previous versions of AMD's technology, will be supported by practically any graphics cards, including Nvidia and even Intel adopters. Initially, FSR 3 will already be available in Forspoken and Immortals of Avenue this fall. It is also confirmed that the technology will be later added to Avatar, Frontiers of Pandora, Cyberpunk 2077, Base Marine 2, Frostpunk 2, The Elder Squad, Starship Troopers, Extermination, Black Myth, Crimson Desert and Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth. Additionally, AMD revealed that the fluid motion frame generation technology will be integrated into the driver in 2024 in such a way that it can be activated in any or almost any game using DirectX 11 or DirectX 12. However, in this case the technology will be part of the HyperRig software package which only works with Radeon RX 7000. It is also worth noting that this implementation of AFMF will be inferior in quality to a full integration of FSR 3 with AFMF by the game developers themselves. Thank you for watching this video and like subscribe to my channel if you want to receive more news about FSR 3.